Hey, what is up, guys? My name is TheArch39, bringing you your Modern Warfare 3 gameplay, playing some TDM on Outpost, which is a snowy, kind of wide open, kind of clustery map, a little bit of everything. I really like pretty much all the maps. I don't really have a problem with any of them. But this time, I'm using the Type 95 Assault Rifle. It looks a lot like the FAMAS in Modern Warfare 2. It is a three-round burst, like the FAMAS was in Modern Warfare 2. And this has become my favorite gun. Why? Because it is a consistent one burst kill. You see I pick up a double kill there. And uh, I knew there was two guys pressing me right by the right by the, the car there. So I just chucked up a Semtex. And boom! Nice little double again. So yeah, this is my new favorite gun. Type 95 Assault Rifle. You unlock it in like level 32, 33. Something of that nature. And I'm level, like, 35 right now, so I just unlocked it. This was one of my first games using it, TDM. And I go big. I go 37 and 4, which is one of my, probably my best game of TDM I've ever played. Black Ops, Modern Warfare 2, 3, combined. Not combined. <laughs> that would be all my scores added up. No, but this is my best TDM game I, have, frankly, I've ever played. And it was, like, with my, my first game with the Type 95. And that probably shows that it's a pretty damn good gun. It is a three-round burst, which puts you at a lot of disadvantages as far as if there's multiple enemies and stuff like that. Like there, ah, damn it. Couldn't get him, couldn't get him. And um, I think I, I rushed back blindly to get my care package. So I'm like, no, nobody take it. Because in Modern Warfare 3, the maps are kind of small, and if they see that care package there, they're going to swarm. Enemies will swarm. It's like a, it's like an enemy magnet right there. But I give it to my buddy Van Sprink, so I'm playing with, playing with like a full party here, which I normally don't do. I should do more. You probably can't see that guy, but that guy's trying to shoot down air support way back there, and I get him finally. He's moving around a little bit. Pick this guy up. I think I get like a triple. I think I get a nice little triple feed in the same exact spot there, uh, coming back later in the game, because you know one burst basically kills a guy in Modern Warfare 3 because. <clears throat> You get killed a lot. Like, if there's one, there's two. Give me that three piece. But yeah, in Modern Warfare 3, people get killed a lot faster. And in Black Ops, you could pump them. You could pump them full of bullets and they won't die. Not in this game. In this game, you get shot. You get shot for about a split second. You're dead. You gotta You gotta be aware. I think right here. No, that's later. But, but yeah, Type 95 is my new favorite gun. I've used a bunch of them. I, I've used the Scar 8, Scar L. The M4A1, that's a pretty good gun. The Scar is good. Spaz, I tried that out. It's not as good as it was in Modern Warfare 2. Which is, I mean, understandable, because that, that was way OP in, in Modern Warfare 2. Um, I've tried some of the snipers out. They're, they're, they're pretty good. If you put quick draw on, you can quick scope with them. Um, what else have I used? PP01 or something like that. I think I'm about to unlock the PP90, or if I might have already done it. I'm not sure. I haven't checked. Um, the UMP, obviously MP5, I've used. Not crazy about them. But this is definitely the best. I mean, you could even put a silencer on it, and it's and it's a one to two shot burst kill every time. Every time. So, if you haven't unlocked it, try it out. Tell me what your guys' favorite gun is. Tell me what the gun is that you've been using the most. Or, or whatever. Tell me... What you think of the guns, think of the maps, think of anything really. Just leave something in the comments and uh, you know, and, and we'll see what we get. But but like I said, Type 95, my my favorite gun so far. And uh, I was just wondering what you guys thought and if you in, in, encountered another weapon that you preferred or whatever, what have you. So, my kill streaks are UAV care package attack helicopter, which is a low thing, a low thing, <laughs> a low assault package assault strike package i don't know there's so many different things put on my care package there but yeah i've i've used assault i've used support and i also have used specialist and i like them all specialist is really hard to do to get all the perks <laughs> uh and that's just in my experience probably because i was playing i don't know exactly what game type i was playing but it was pretty difficult to get this predator missile there's a bunch of them around there, but I'm lucky I got that <laughs> that one. But yeah, Predator Missile. Um, yeah, what was I talking about? 
Oh yeah, a specialist. Where you can unlock each... If you get seven kills, you have every perk in the game or something like that. The, their first two kills gets you an extra perk, so you have four. Your sixth, your fourth kill or fifth kill gets you another perk, so you'll end up with five. And then if you get another kill, you'll have six. And then if you get like a seventh, you have every every perk in the entire game pro. Not pro. Every perk in the entire game at once. Which is pretty awesome. I've never gotten that high. So so I can't tell you what it's like, but I'm, I'm sure it's pretty freaking sweet. But I have used the support class, which you can you can set really high kill streaks on the support because even if you die, you can still get there. Like say you have you're on a seven kill streak and you have like a, a nine or something, a nine support package, and you die, you're like, oh no. I, but it doesn't matter because get sprayed. It doesn't not matter because y your kill streaks your streak continues even if you die on the support. So usually, if you have a hard time building kill streaks and you still want to get stuff, do support because it also helps out your team, and you can get a really like you can get escort drops and stuff and juggernaut armor and everything. You can get so much stuff support streaks. Um, right here, I there was a couple people going for the care my care package again, so I had to deal with them. Get sprayed down. Look at that. Just hip fire, hip fire them, man. That's craziness. This gameplay is almost over already. You got the IMS. Which is, you put it on the ground, if people go near it, it shoots up like these discs, and like, it shoots like a disc at them and it explodes. So if usually if you put that in a location where people usually travel, it's, it's a good idea. I think I get the, I, I know I get the final kill of the game. And this was recorded in theater mode, so theater mode shows the kill cam, which is nice. Because that, that wasn't so in Black Ops. But here's the final kill cam. One burst, as you'll see, right to his body, kills him. Boom. Easy as that. Well, anyway, guys, my name is the Arch39. One of my, probably my best TDM ever, 37 and 4 on whatever this map is called. The, it'll be, it'll be in the description. But um, leave a, leave a like. You know, tell me what your favorite gun is in the comments, and um, and we'll see what we come up with. All right, peace.